Hi, and welcome to the new Maestro video series. We will cover quite a lot in the series, which will be comprised of two main segments. The first will include an introduction to Maestro. We will start with what is Maestro, how it came to be, and which challenges does it meet. We will talk about why Maestro is a leading solution of its kind in the market, and what does it give you, our customers. Then. We will unbox an orchestrator and go on with showing you an actual live build of a Maestro security group and walk you through the connections and initial steps to make it operational with tips and suggestions to make your Maestro deployment as smooth and hassle-free as possible. The second segment will include six parts, each covering a different Maestro use case in a set of videos we have prepared especially for this presentation. We will go through the key use cases for Maestro that will help you visualize all that we have discussed at the beginning. First would be the software installation and security group definition. We'll also talk about mix and match, Checkpoint's unique feature that allows using different appliance models in the same security group and why this is important. Then we will track a network packet as it journeys through the Maestro highways. The third use case will show what happens when we remove one of the security group members, a use case that will drive home the huge advantages of using Maestro to run your clusters. We will then proceed to show how easy it is to add a member to a security group. And the fifth use case will take us even further, how you can utilize members from different security groups to help overcome anticipated traffic peaks to a specific security group. And finally, we will go over the common management and maintenance routines that will close the series with showing how easy it is to upgrade and monitor security groups and their members. So let's dive into it. Network clusters in general are created to optimize your network's performance and resiliency. Having said that, this concept can go wrong in many ways because the way to simplifying things often creates very complex journeys. Maestro is a patent-based technology, meaning that a single core development is at the heart of achieving the end objective that lies in a robust, efficient, and scalable cluster solution. I am referring to the Sync Excel technology, also known as HyperSync. HyperSync uses Unicast to synchronize connections between Checkpoint appliances. For those of you watching this video and learning of the Maestro solution for the first time, let's go over some basic terms that you will encounter when operating a Maestro cluster. First and foremost is Maestro, a hyperscale network security solution. The term Maestro comes from the world of music and refers to a distinguished conductor of classical music. The conductor is a key, central person that leads and guides the orchestra, or to use a different word, the orchestrator. This is why the orchestrator is the heart of Maestro. Either the Maestro Hyperscale Orchestrator 140 or the Maestro Hyperscale Orchestrator, which we will refer to from now on as MHO the MHO-175. The MHO is the lead, guide, and orchestrator of the traffic going to and from the security groups in its domain. Sound simple? Well, it isn't. Exactly like a maestro in a big orchestra, having to coordinate up to 100 musicians, the orchestrator's job in a maestro cluster is far from simple. The orchestrator manages the traffic distribution and scalability of appliance and network segments in a fully redundant cluster that can have up to 52 members divided in up to eight of these network segments we call security groups, which we will explain very shortly. All those appliances are managed via an SMO, a single management object 
that is comprised of a group of appliances and interfaces represented as a single gateway on the security management. Each SMO provides the flexibility to add and remove appliances according to business needs without requiring specific and individual changes in the management. Every security group has an SMO, which is a physical appliance that manages the members in that specific group. These are its responsibilities. Forward the traffic on the management interface, clone the settings and policies to all other members, negotiate link aggregation control protocol with external switches, and is responsible for the image cloning process when the security group is initiated and expanded, using itself as the source to clone. This brings us back to explaining what a security group is a segregated cluster within a Maestro deployment. You can set up up to eight security groups in a single Maestro deployment, each with their own security profile independently enforcing it as any other gateway in your management server. Now that we have established the language we will be speaking, let's see how Maestro meets the industry and customer challenges to become a unique leading solution.